All right, we're back at it again. So today, I'm going to be playing through all of the contest entries for the Range 21 contest, which, as far as I'm aware, was pretty much just about geometric shapes. I think there are only like four or five entries, and unfortunately, I have seen the judges' results. And by unfortunately, I mean that I'll probably be a little biased. But I haven't seen anything about the scripts themselves. So let's give them a try. And first up is Kogasa by J Dude. Yeah, this is this is a Reimu that he says this was balanced around. Okay. Ooh, I like this remix. And here we go. Ooh. Squares and circles. And yeah. Oh, I was... And... Ooh! This is scary. Ugh. Ah, that's really tight. Oh yeah, it's aimed. Ah! Uh, I just realized I don't have unlimited lives, so I'm gonna have to be careful here. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Ooh. Oh, what? Oh. I did not realize that was going to spread out. What are those candies? Oh. Okay. One more time. Okay, yeah, so the circles are aimed, so I'm gonna have to misdirect them. Yeah. It's really tight. Is it not aimed? Because that one came straight at. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not taking any chances. Ah. Yeah, the tricky part here is that the laser triangles are obscuring the bullets. So it looks like the bullets are ad rendered. Might have been a better choice to make them alpha rendered here. Yeah, what are these? Are they candies? I don't know. They look really pretty though. Yeah, the thing about that laser indicator is that it's really misleading. I thought it would have just been a three-way shot that I could get between. I didn't realize it was just gonna fill that whole area with laser. Ah, that was on me. Okay. Rain Cyclone. Ooh. Ah, oh, I really like this. Ooh. At least the bomb's pretty strong. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, hello. So I guess I just hang out down here. Oh. Oh, I didn't realize those were coming for me. <laughs> yeah, let's just play it safe. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, last lie. Ooh. Oh, those are really fast. Okay, they slow down. Hey, hey, I got an extra, oh, I got an extra life and I immediately lost it. Oh man. <laughs> uh. Well, I'll be right back. All right, and I'm back. Ooh, those, 
those bullets are kind of a cheap shot if you don't know they're coming. <laughs> ah. Okay. Rainy rainbow. <laughs> Whoa. Ooh. Getting a little rainbow raven here. Oh. Eyes getting dense. It's pretty dense. Yeah, just gonna bomb be safe here. Geometra Karakasa. Ooh. Oh, this is the take on Keiki's spell, Geometric Creature. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is dense. Oh. Stream. Ah, uh, I made it, but I panicked. <laughs> okay. All right, so that's JJ's script. So, very pretty. I like the designs of a lot of the Danmaku. And some of the patterns and spells were really fun, like, oh, I forgot the name of it, but it was um, that one spell with the heart bullets and the bullets that start off really fast and then slow down. I really like that one. And I'm probably not just saying that because that's the only spell I could capture. But um, there, yeah, unfortunately, there were a couple of parts where, like, just the bullets were really random and really dense, like with that last spell. No, not the last spell, the second to last spell. But yeah, some of them were a bit too fast, a bit too dense, or like with that one part in the previous run where I got a one-up and then I immediately lost it because I got cheap shot by those fast bullets. And yeah, I already mentioned earlier, there are some parts that are a bit misleading. I think the fact that like there's only one difficulty setting here probably works against this because I know that I'm not like the best best player and it says here difficulty is hard to lunatic and I'm more of a hard mode player myself but yeah I great concepts but I think just um difficulty balancing needs some fine-tuning and a couple other small design choices so yeah on to the next one alrighty next up is Foxygami hmm. I don't know if that's a different username for someone or if that's someone I've never seen before but let's see what they got Ooh, we can pick whatever. Oh, you know me. Whenever I have free choice, I pretty much always pick this Raymu. <laughs> the same Raymu I use for all of my own scripts. Ooh. All right. Pretty standard race and attack. Oh, so it looks like she has one bar, but just several checkpoints. Is there any particular reason why these bullets are semi-transparent? Hmm. Hmm. Simple, but effective. Oh! Ooh! They're converging! That is really cool. Oh! That is really neat, actually. That is super neat. Ooh! So it looks like I can micro or macro dodge these, especially the triangles, because the triangles aren't too dense. But yeah, seems macro dodging works fine here. I feel like this one could stand to be a little more difficult though. Peduncular hall hallucinosis. Hmm. Whoa. 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 Oh, I see. Ooh. Oh, is that music fading out intentional? Because that was really neat. Oh, it is fading out the music. Oh, that's neat. Oh, that is... Oh, that was my fault. <laughs> okay, this is really neat. <laughs> and
And the shapes! If I just go up here... Yeah, I'll be safe up here. Then I can come down here. Ooh! Need to find a better way to optimize my strategy for this, but this is really neat. Okay, get some damage on her. Get some more damage. There we go. Oop, looks like a bit of a leftover from the previous spell got. Ooh. Okay, this is really neat. It's very scary, but not too bad, actually. Ah, oh, that was pretty short. Senseless Glaucoma. <laughs> These names are interesting. Oh. Oh. Ooh. What's she doing? Mm. Gotta move very carefully here. Oh. Oh, and then when she does that, you can see all of them. I'm not... I'm gonna play it safe here. I don't want to have to restart. Oop! Okay, there we go. Ooh. Oop. Aw, oh, I skipped that non-spell. Stravismus bomb. You're just throwing a bunch of medical terms out here, I see. Oh. Ooh. A nice slow dodge. Fire anything? Oh, 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 jeez! I might have. I might. Yeah, I'm in trouble. Oh no, I'm not. Oh, getting out. Getting out. Getting out. Okay, and then I'll misdirect it up here. Ha ha ha! I'm a genius. But no, this spell is really well designed. I like it. Spell card bonus one! Why? <laughs> uh, like anyone plays for score anyway. I mean, I don't. <laughs> okay. Pretty simple, pretty short, but I really like that. Like, um, especially that last spell. That was really fun. And um, the one where she was firing out the bursts and then converging them. Like, I really like the gimmick of having the bullets converge. And then you having to just avoid them once they burst out into shapes. Nice little touch that you make the music fade out whenever she does her lunatic red eyes thing. Yeah. Um, yeah. I guess that's probably just about it. Um, I might put some more thoughts in the captions. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward, but I really like that. All right, on to the next one. All right, I'm back. And this time, it looks like I'm in Damakafu Woo Edition. I've never actually played any Woo Edition games yet, so this will be a first. And up next is Porygon Z by who else but EX Porygon. How very on brand. Thief Team. Oh, hello. Ooh. Fancy. Oh, I almost thought those ones and zeros were bullets for a second. Hello! Okay, there we go. Alright! Nice simple starter. Ooh, ooh. There we go. Ooh, I like that clean. Oh, hello. Ones and zeros. Oh! Oh! <laughs> there we go. Okay, let me see. Okay, so the ones and zeros do kill you, but you have like a bit of a grace period, it seems. Oh! Not that much of a grace period, it seems. <laughs> Ooh. 
I really like this non spell. It took me off guard though, so I had to panic bomb. Oh, give me that one up. Yes. Oh, do I have to get in there? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, last life. Let's not squander it. Not today! <clears throat> I like how they give me a one up piece after each attack. I'm probably gonna die though. Oh, I did not need to use that there. I panicked again. Oh, it's the binary things again. Oh, I didn't get out in time. Oh, what? How am I not dead? I thought that was my last life. Oh. Okay, if I'm not dead, I'm definitely dead now. Um. Oh, I guess it doesn't automatically reset. Gotta do that myself. Okay, I'll be right back. All right, I am back. Oh, I got in the wrong one. Oh, this is going fast. Oh, those bullets didn't delete in time. That was close. Oh, oh, <laughs> they look like worms. I love it. <laughs> Those are really nifty looking. Oh. Oh. Neat. Alright. And there it is. Woo! All right, that was really fun. So I have, of course, had to reset there because I died. But on the second playthrough, it's a lot more manageable. So definitely, I don't think of a uh, script that you could beat on your first try, but it's really quick to play through. So I don't mind replaying it at all. And it was really fun. Like, it comes at you fast and hard, but... The patterns are just really pretty, really creative, and the ones in like the ones and zero blocks thing. I feel like I probably would have liked that a bit more. Like if with the first spell, there's a better indicator of which. Sorry, if which one would become dangerous first, because I couldn't quite tell which one would start off being the dangerous one. But um, I really liked it, and. Yeah, it's challenging, fast, but just really fun once you get the hang of it. Like, it's tough, but fair, I would say. Very tough, but fair. Um, again, like, I imagine a lot of these um, contest entries must have been a little pressed for time because they weren't able to make multiple difficulty settings. But, yeah, like, that was fun for my level. I hope that, like, it's not too inaccessible due to the difficulty, but, yeah, very fun. I said fun like five times now. <laughs> I really liked it. All right. Here I am once more in another instance of Don Makufu Woo Edition. And next up is Nue by Lucis. Ultima Reinu. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Also, it looks like I could have a lot of lives here, so I have some room to make errors. Alignment to stars. Ooh. Are they gonna convert into shapes? They are! Oh! <laughs> that is really neat. Uh. 
Okay, let's see if I can figure out where they're headed. Yes, there we go. Ha ha. Not this time. This one's really neat. Oop. Ha ha. Ooh, this one keeps you on your toes. Oh. I do wish there was a little more warning when the bullets were spawning in because it's hard to tell if one's spawning right on top of you. Oh! Oh, now this is an interesting way to use shapes. They're kind of collapsing, or they're kind of rotating. That is really neat. Really, really neat. Slithering creature. Is it going to be like those diamond bullets in Porygon script <laughs> look like worms. Ooh. 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 I can't believe I survived that. Ooh. This one's fun. Scary, but fun. Also, how did I survive that? the amulet wave. Aha! Uh -huh. Alien abduction! Aliens! Ew! So it's a cylinder, so it looks like the dark bullets can't affect me. Yep, can't hurt me. Cylinders! Oh, there's another cylinder of people. <laughs> oh, here come the bullets again. Ah! Yeah, I should not go near the edge there. They get really dense there. Oh, oh, that was short, but that was really fun. I love the designs on that. Like that was just really creative. Oop. Save Ripali. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, that was really fun. Really, really fun. Like the Damaka design was just, just top notch. Really creative. Very fun. I wish it was a bit longer, but hey. There's always something to be said for quality over quantity. So yeah, I don't have much to say about that, but that was really fun. Oh, like I said, I think really the only complaint I had is for that spell with the stars spawning in. I would have liked it if maybe there was a bit of a spawn delay for them instead of just having them fade in because it's kind of hard to tell like if they're spawning near you or right on top of you until it's a bit too late. But I love the ideas. I love the designs. Very pretty, very colorful. Great, I loved it. On to the final one. All right, I'm speaking to you from the future. And after speaking with Bagom, or however you pronounce his name, sorry if I butchered it, he managed to give me a copy of this game that actually runs at the proper FPS. So let's give it a try now. It's many months overdue, but let's see. Okay, all right, much better. Now we're not running at like a million miles per hour anymore. I actually dodge this. All right. Oh, oh. oh man, I am just, I don't know if I'm gonna have the footage of this. I'll probably show a little bit of the footage from my first recording of this, but the FPS was so messed up that <laughs> it was literally just impossible to dodge. But I'm not going to show the full footage of that because it was pretty much just me saying over and over, Oh my god! Oh my god! This is so undodgeable! This is so unfair! But yeah, it turned out that was not how it was intended to be played. Go figure. Ooh, these lasers are still kind of scary. Oop. Ooh. Hmm. 
Not really sure how I'm supposed to be able to predict those lasers. You can kind of see when they're forming. Mm. Yeah. So even at this speed, I'm not sure how I feel about this one, though. Oh, managed to dodge that properly. All right. Okay. So pretty. Oh man, it's like bending my eyes. Notably, I, I did see that this script doesn't really have a difficulty select, which is unfortunate, but at least at this level, like, it's actually playable. Here. I think this was one of the one where she's gonna be able to, yeah, she's moving around a lot. Oop, hello. Let's get out of there. Whoop. Let's see if I can squeeze. Okay, not quite. Ah! Okay. Ooh, that is really Ooh. Ooh. I'm you know, I'm guessing that's probably aimed and I messed it up. Okay, let's see if I can try to move as little as possible here. And then let's see if the pattern becomes more apparent. Oh yeah, I can just step right down there, avoid the triangles. Oh, if I go like this and I can shoot her on the side. Are you gonna do anything? Hello? But yeah, I guess this is an opportunity to show off that you can actually like control which direction you're shooting. Pretty neat little feature, kind of awkward because you have to use WASD. But yeah, looks like here I'll just shoot her down. Eh? Hello? Okay. Alright, we're back at it again. And hopefully it won't freeze after the first cycle again. And as I suspected, this wave is aimed. So yeah, I can actually dodge this. It looks really scary. But no, nah, just move carefully. Believe in tiny hitbox. And you're fine. Alright! Alright! It didn't freeze! Perfect! Ooh, it's 3D! Ooh. Oh man, this is melting my mind! But it's fun! I mean, I'm wondering if I'm just speaking this way because the first version of this I played was like, inhumanly fast. But no, this is actually really fun. Like, it's, it's really challenging. Like, that's the thing about this whole script now. I've gone from like, oh, this is so unfair to, this is, this is challenging, but really fun. Ooh. I don't remember if this was the last attack or not. It might be. I think I remember this now, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, shooting beams. So this is where you have to try to use that Oh, uh, yeah, I might be able to shoot downward. Yep, there we go. Oh, she moved. But yeah, you can actually move which direction you're shooting in. All right, let's get some shots off on her. Oop, got hit there. Woo! Oh, my finger slipped. So I wasn't able to move out of the way in time. Alright. Not sure how I managed to hit her on that one. I'm wondering if that one might have been better as a survival spell just because of how much she's moving. Oop! I should not be in there. I gotta stay out here. Okay, I got it. Yeah. I just... Oop! Gotta watch out for those. Oh yeah, because they're like big rectangles. 
so I just gotta watch out for the corners. Yeah, there we go. And I guess the music stopped looping. Oh well. Alright, that one was really fun. Ooh! We're getting Sane up in here. Are those suns? Those are Utsuho's suns. <laughs> Ooh, there's a lot going on here. Let's see if I can parse it out. Parse it out. Eh. Oh! Is that a different music track? Huh. Those lasers look really neat. By the way. Oh, there's more. Oh. This is similar to the one from before. Oh, but it's faster. Oh, so less dense, but faster. Woo! That's harrowing. Oop. Oop. Ooh, this is fun. <laughs> Huh. Huh. Okay. We're doing good. Alright. That sun creeps me out. Oh, gotta get out of the way. Not sure if those lasers are aimed, but definitely don't want to be in their way. Okay, they're not necessarily aimed, but they're just trying to catch you off guard when you move out of the way of the wave before. Ooh! Ooh! I can't believe I dodged that. Let's see if I can get over back over here. Over here. Alright. I didn't broke anything for boss death. <laughs> Still didn't fix that. Okay, well you know that's that's just alright with me. Okay, I guess I'll just leave this, leave this here while I get my final thoughts. Okay, so I recorded my video, my very first video for this script like a very long time ago, but it turns out that with the way that like the script is programmed, like it's, I'm not like super good with the technical stuff like this, but from what I understood, because of the way that certain things worked, this script was running at 120 FPS for me, which is basically double speed. And it was just completely unplayable, and I just kind of written off, written it off before. It's just like, oh, it's just it's unplayable. It's impossible. But I actually spoke with the script creator. Of this it's been really awesome, and he helped me work out what was wrong. And he also, actually, I shouldn't say he because I don't know if they're he or she. They worked on this script, and they changed a little bit of the code to make sure that it would be able to work on my system because for some reason I can't change the refresh rate on my screen. So yeah, all that to say, bottom line, this is really fun now. I really like it. It's unfortunate that there is no difficulty select because it seems that this is definitely one of the mo on the more challenging end of the spectrum. So people who are um, not as good at Damaku wouldn't be able to put, enjoy this as much. But you do have infinite lives, so it's not like that's too much of a problem. But for my skill level, like, I really enjoyed it. It was very fun. I'll probably have some more detailed commentary and the annotations. But overall, very fun. Challenging, very fun, and actually fair. Now that it's not running at 120 FPS. So yeah, i just like to, again, big shout out to Bagaum, however you pronounce their name again. If I've been mispronouncing their name this entire time, I'm going to feel really bad. But they're really awesome, really great scripter, and they actually have been making some other scripts, really is, um, as well. They made some really great scripts for the Toho Pride Jam 2, which just came out, like, not too long ago. I might do some videos on that as well, but keep a lookout for those. But Bagel made, like, two scripts for those, and they're great. So check those out, and thank you for sticking around. Oh god, this is a lot. Ah! Uh. How am I supposed to? Oh! What the? Ah! Oh, that is a lot. 
I mean, those laser effects are really pretty, but I just keep dying. Oh, jeez. Oh, geez. they keep hitting. Ah! Ow! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. How am I... Oh, what? How am I supposed to dodge that? What? Oh! What? Whoa! Oh! Oh! This is really fast. Oh, jeez. Whoa! Too much, man! That Damagu was just way too hard.